The wife of Zimbabwe's vice president will spend Christmas behind bars after the magistrate's court remanded her in custody to December the 30th on attempted murder charges. Here is CGTN's Farai Mwakutia with the details. Mary Mbaiwa is alleged to have tampered with her husband's medical equipment while he was receiving medical care in neighboring South Africa in July this year. The vice president had been unwell and was out of the country getting medical attention for four months, initially in India and South Africa and eventually in China. His estranged wife's arrest coincides with comments he made over the weekend at a ZANU-PF conference where he warned that the purge on corruption would spare no one, including those people who know him personally. It also comes soon after he filed divorce papers against her last week. Mbaiwa also faces 11 counts of money laundering and foreign currency externalization involving hundreds of thousands of dollars used to purchase a house, two luxury vehicles and furniture in South Africa. She denies all the charges. Justice will prevail at the end of the day, so we don't have to worry about that. While the magistrate's court has denied bail, a higher court can overturn that decision. And earlier today, the defense team said that is the next port of call as they plan to lodge an appeal at the master of the high court. Farai Makutuya, CGTN, Harare, Zimbabwe.